guys, welcome to our new English class. Today, we are going to study a new topic. Let's see. That topic is going to be frequency adverbs presented by me. The adverbs of frequency. Let's see a conversation about some guys that are talking about an exam. They use the frequency adverbs in all the conversation. Let's see. I got an F again. I got an A plus. You got an A plus again. How do you do it? Well, I always do my homework and I often ask the teacher for help. Mm, well, I'm usually late for class and I never do my homework. Maybe I need to try your study habits. Well, you see, in that conversation, they were making use of the frequency adverbs, but now let's begin. Adverbs of frequency say how often something happens. Here we have a scale that goes from 0% to 100%. We have always, usually, and often at the very top. The meaning of always is siempre. Usually, usualmente, often, a menudo. And we have an example there. He always studies. He usually studies. He often studies. And we also have, for the 50%, sometimes, he sometimes studies. Why? Because he doesn't study every single day, just some days. Then we have rarely and never. And the example is, he rarely studies. He never studies. And you see the example there. But where is the position that I need to place my frequency adverb in a sentence? Well, that's a good question. Let's see. Adverbs of frequency come after the verb to be. If the sentence we are going to use has a the conjugation of the verb to be, so the frequency adverb is going to come after the verb to be. For example, she is sometimes late. The verb to be is, the word is. And after that, we have sometimes, that is the frequency adverb. The students are never bored. In this case, we have the frequency adverb never after the word are. But what about words that are not verb to be, but others? We have adverbs of frequency usually come before other verbs. For example, she often checks her answers. He usually pays attention in class. If I ask you, where is the main verb in the first one? Okay, it's checks. And what about the second one? It's pays. Usually and sometimes can also come at the beginning or at the end of a sentence. Here I have an example for you to realize that we can use usually and sometimes at the beginning, at the middle, or at the end of a sentence. How? The dog eats his homework sometimes. Sometimes the dog eats his homework. The dog sometimes eats his homework. And you can see that the three sentences are correct. We also have questions with how often. Use how often to ask about frequency. Let's see this example. How often do you study with a partner? I rarely study with a partner. You see, we can answer the question how often using one of the frequency adverbs that we have been studying. But now we have a practice. How often, space, you, and then you have to complete with an activity. For example, we have these two phrases, fall asleep studying and be tired. How would you make that sentence or that question? Let's see. How often do you fall asleep studying? Very good. Let's see the number two. How would you make that sentence? 
Yes, how often are you tired? And that's the way. But now I have some work for you. I have six sentences in which you are going to do the same. How often do you? And you continue with the phrase I give you. For example, the first one, how often do you study in a group? You can make your own answers and in the next class I will check. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. See you later.